Is that a little heat? Jerry, is that a little heat? Sounds good. I'm having fun with these guitars. You picked out two glorious morsels. Uh, this one is the one ending in serial number 98. And uh, boy, it sounds good. And it certainly it's a beautiful thing to behold. Yeah, a little push in the low mids, but a very, very nice one, very articulate. It's got a squishy tone. When you lean into the strings, it kind of gives a little bit. It breathes. And that's what I look for in a Lester Pulfus model. And to be honest, 99% uh, of all of these custom shop Tom Murphys and Wildwood Spec ones have that to an extent. And uh, let's go this one. but not maybe as much as that one. A little faster attack. But glorious.
It's interesting, these guitars behave differently. When they're clean, they have their different nuances, but then as soon as you put the overdrive on, this amp really has a tendency to reflect the note separation and clarity of the guitar, where sometimes it gets real musty and it sounds all fizzy, and other times you can hear every string and it just sounds tighter in the low end and more defined, and uh, it's just always a good, uh, a good example of uh, what it's going to sound like with gain on. Can you dig it? I hope that helps, Jerry. They're both beautiful instruments. I don't think you can go wrong with either one, but hopefully this little demo will help you in your decision-making process. Thanks for, thanks for requesting it. We'll talk to you soon. Good luck.